Hello guys, welcome to the next episode of Gungeon. Streaming a bit late today. Uh, three gun nuts. Uh, a bit late today, we had a few issues with the internet connection. Uh, it just cut out for some unknown reason. But we're back on again. So we're going to make up for lost time. So many issues today. Roggy Bear Jr. How you doing, dude? <laughs> nice pick. Straight in, gonna go for the Pilot passed again today. Uh, so close yesterday. Uh, actually, we were so close yesterday that it should have been a thing. Uh, also hunting the gun nuts. So we've got three more of those to get. So that should get done in this run, hopefully, if we come across a few. Um, and there was something else we're trying to do. I can't quite remember what it is at the moment. Check the shop out real quick, see if there's anything worth buying in there. Uh, so, Table Tech Rage, uh, 30 and 21, so 51 in total. Uh, they're definitely items worth buying. So, hopefully we can build up the money. I mean, 51 isn't, isn't a hard amount to collect on the first floor. Especially with the pilot. We've got the cheaper items anyway, so... Otherwise, they'd cost a bit more. Um, yeah, let's do it. Got the Phoenix. We'll save that for the boss uh, and or future floors. I'll try and just use the Rogue Special to begin with. I don't know why I tried that, because that gun doesn't show secret rooms. Um, might try an elevator go run today. Um, we'll kind of see how things go. Probably not on this run though. Next run or any concurrent runs after that. For now, I just want to try and defeat the past. Ah, bad damage there. That'd get some good heart drops today. Haven't seen a gun nut yet, which is odd because normally we see one. Um, oh, the caped bullets as well. We're going to find the caped bullets uh, to unlock the bullet character, which we've only found the one so far. But I'm sure in time we'll find those. So I'm not too worried. As long as we recognise them as soon as they appear and make sure we don't shoot them, then we should be okay. Uh, quite easy to see. Uh, they don't attack us. Ah, oh, bad damage there. They don't attack us and they do have a nice red cape so we can see, we can sort of differentiate between uh, who's who just going to pull our socks off a bit and try and play a bit better, we do have a spare heart sitting over there Seems like a bigger floor than normal. But I ain't complaining. At least we'll get... Well, actually, I was going to say, uh, at least we get the money. But we've only got 15 so far, which is odd. I'm sure we've normally got more than that by now. I suppose taking damage lowers your chance of collecting cash. So we should probably ease up on taking damage if we can. Well, I mean, we can. We've done it before. We've, we've got the first two floors, first three floors, without taking any da damage before, so... Uh, this shouldn't be too much of an issue to do. But if anything, 
Um, we probably want to get the key rather than the table tech item. I think we're going to get more benefits or more early on benefits uh, from that. Okay, so there's a the second gun that. Or oh, is that the third? Well, I'm going to call it second just to play it safe. Um, should we try for the secret floor today? Uh, I'll tell you what, we'll go straight to the boss now and see how we do for money. Uh, we'll use the Phoenix. So we've got the Bullet King. Both blank still, so as long as we're careful. Too close for comfort there. Can you not set him on fire? Can't lure him over here. Keep him to the edges of the screen if possible. Dodging. Getting help early on is definitely good for our survival. His gun is quite doing it for us though today. It's taking a long time to get that damage down. But we've got plenty of ammo left. As long as we keep playing carefully, we'll be okay. We're almost there. Still got a blank, which I'm sure we're gonna have to use probably about now. <laughs> oh no, you stay away from me, you. Right, then don't screw it up just now. Nice. So we've got our flawless. Uh, you know, we'll destroy the chair. Somebody said it's worth doing that, but I'm not entirely convinced it's of any use. Uh, we've got the bundle of wands, which is a fantastic item. Uh, and 83, so we're going to go back to the shop. We're going to buy both the key and the table tech. Go open that chest and then we'll head down. So it's two brown chests, I believe. Uh, but we've got the six for this one, which you know, we've got some health lying around. So, and I'm not entirely sure whether I've worked this out right with six, but we can use it twice. Come and get our health back, and that should help or aid in our cooldown. Uh, you know what, let's try for the secret floor. There was a fireplace here? No, fireplace is over there. Uh, so we're looking for a water barrel. Uh, there's one here. So it's going to take a minute just to move it up. And I'm kind of hoping that our lockpick is going to be, oh, I'll tell you what actually, you know, we're going to be able to use the lockpick once and then it's going to, actually does that only happen when the lockpick doesn't work? I'll tell you what, we're going to test something out real quick because I'm not entirely sure. The lockpick, whether uh, if you get a successful use out of it, whether you can use it again or whether you've got to wait for it to charge again, I'm not entirely sure. But we're going to find out. There's only one way to find these things out, and it's to actually try them. So our room is over there. Just head on over. I can see my camera slipping down again. Uh, no, well, it didn't work anyway. So, but it was worth the try. I have to adjust my camera again. Sorry, guys. Oops. Slipping for some reason. I'm not entirely sure why. That's better. Down to the next one. Is that another room there? What? Never seen this before. Aha. We've got to do it, haven't we? Extra health for a bit of curse. I think it's worth it. So up on five hearts. Just coming out of the first floor. That's not a bad start. If we can keep that up, 
Uh, we've got some good weapons there as well. Phoenix and the Bundler Ones. So Bundler Ones, uh, I'm going to save for now. Maybe use that on bosses and or hard enemies. And uh, we use the Phoenix and the Rogue for just the regular rooms. Ro uh, the Rogue on normal enemies and maybe the Phoenix on the slightly bigger ones. Like that. So I'd rather not take damage from this guy. Fairly easy to dodge the attacks on this room. I thought I was going to take damage just as I, oh, I was going to take damage just as I said that. Um, so as per usual, uh, I'm going to be looking for some weapon mods as well. Um, every time we get one or two weapon mods, we tend to have re real good runs, uh, and if not beat the game, we come very close to doing so. So. Uh, frost bullets, shock bullets, bouncing bullets, anything of the sorts I'll be happy to, uh, to find. Ah, bad damage there. That was uh, one of those unavoidable, that wasn't, one of those unavoidable shots that you you kind of dodge roll out of the way of one bullet and another one flies right up in your face. Now I'm going to get these guys out of the way as soon as these shock, shock bullets. Uh, so we've taken a whole three hearts of damage on this floor, so that would have been a death if we hadn't have had the flawless and the um, heart container. Which is pretty bad, uh, all said and done. I'm not quite getting the full effect of this weapon. If we can do that, there we go. Set them on fire. Alright, we're going to pick that up straight away just to augment our health a bit. Get that last shot in. Oh, we missed. That's alright. Now, I wouldn't mind having heart synthesizer on this run if we can find it. Uh, how much does he want? 30. Can't afford him at the moment, but... I think we'll definitely go back to him. Provided there's not anything too important in the shop that we need. Uh, or if maybe... Well, actually, if, if both our chests are low tier, I'm pretty confident that we could get a blue chest or better in those particular rooms, in, uh, in the gun game. Oh, I didn't realise he was going to pop off so soon. Bad play so far. Well, good play on the first floor, bad play on the second floor, we'll say. Maybe we should just use the Phoenix exclusively for now, until we run out of ammo. Oh, man, really? Managed to get a hit in there. Oh, man. <laughs> this is not good. She's setting on fire through the wall. No. Uh, did get an extra blank. Ah, oh, there's that ammo. Just not close enough to get that fire damage on those earlier shots. done without this room. But they're going to go down pretty swiftly. Um, we do have a bit of curse, so we are going to get uh, the, uh, the occasional jammed enemy. We've only got one curse, I believe. Uh, you know what? Let's go straight in here. Fight the boss. Um, we should be okay with three blanks. I do want to go for a flawless though as well, so I want to be careful on how we approach this fight. Don't want to do anything too crazy. Probably should have dodge roll there, uh, dodge rolled there, but uh, we've got the range. Actually, 
she's going to go down without too much of a fight. So there's another flawless, so we'll get some health back for this one here. We've also got the cold 45 to armor as well. That's pretty sweet. Shoot her. Um, so bundle of wands, 108, I think that's the one we want to... Yeah. Fill that one back up. Uh, and we'll make it all the way back to the beginning. <coughs> Uh, and we'll use the cold 45 on the floor now, because uh, that's, uh, I feel better than the Phoenix. Um, just purely on the fact it's got um, better effects, you know, we've got to come in close with the Phoenix to get the effects of fire. Got loads of money on that floor, uh, that room. Um, but with a cold 45, uh, we can keep our distance. Decoy could be something quite interesting. Uh, we do have the cigarette still, though. Uh, we'll buy the key. We'll make a uh, decision a bit later on about that one. Uh, if we can still... But then we'll get the curse. So it's all down to whether we want to have this... Um, jammed, en jammed enemies uh, popped up everywhere. You know, I just had a fly fly right into my face. Right into my eye. Seems like everything's against me today. Bad internet connection. Flies all around. Bad play on the second floor. Uh, but we've got a blank back. Uh, so we should be able to find uh, the secret room on this floor. That guy just straight up murdered himself then. Uh, still doing okay for ammo for the gun. So, ah oh man. What's that? Zilla shotgun. Quadruple the fun. Oh, nice. I've never seen this one before. So, have we cleared the floor? Oh my god. Oh my god. That was super fast. Okay. So let's go open this chest up. We'll try the lockpick first. No. Nope. Got some spread on this. I'll tell you what, I'm not too peeved about that. Health is right. We'll go play the gun game. Time our rights. Time our rights. Time our shots uh, rightly. I can't be on tomorrow. Oh, that's right, Bryce. I won't be streaming tomorrow anyway. How you doing anyway? All good tonight? I was on a bit late tonight. Uh, my internet connection decided it was going to fail on me. Um, how do we get this one? With a bit of luck. No. Okay. Well, we've got a green chest. So, even so, there'll be something good in there. The hexagon, excellent. Um, where is our secret room likely to be? Up here? Yeah, nice. And we've got a key and another blank. Which we can carry through to the next floor, so that'd be pretty handy. Hope everything's all right, Bryce. Uh, let's just go straight down. I know you can get two secret rooms on a floor. Sometimes. But I don't know how they work or how they spawn, so uh, I'll never. If if I found one, I won't bother looking for a second one, unless we've got about twenty blanks, which never happens anyway. Um, let's go left. Just straight up miss. You know what? I think we'll stick with the cold forty-five to begin with. Actually, you know what? Screw it. We're going to use the hexagon because uh, chances are we will get an ammo drop anyway. So, and this will help us clear out rooms a bit faster and kill some of these more annoying enemies that we don't want to fuck with. Oh, yeah, I forgot we had the table tech rage as well. Let's open this one straight up. Uh, what does that want to do? Uh, heals up. 
give us extra heals or extra heart drops. Chance to improve healing received. Experiment. Okay, so that's going to take us uh, places. Uh, you know what? Let's try that in here. Nope, nothing. But at least we don't have to go through that room again. Uh, you know what? We're going to have to go that way again anyway. So we'll come up here, go left again. I just didn't want to go through that uh, room with all the bullets again, just in case we do take some stupid damage. down at arms for this guy today. Although our HP is not good, um, we're not at the point that we need to be giving away guns for health at the moment. I've got another one of these. Uh, I'll tell you what, Elder Blank and Cigarettes is the place to be. So as soon as we can afford that, we're going to come back for that. Um, I saw Cobalt do that before. Uh, I don't know whether they patched it out or not, but we'll soon find out. So if that's the case, it'll be an automatic win, which I'm down for. Definitely, definitely down for. Up until the past, anyway. If we get to the past, uh, then we'll have a few issues with that, because we'll have to fight that one, legit. Oops. Turn to chickens again. Seem to have a big theme around chickens on our runs recently. But it's all good. As long as they're dying, I ain't bothered. Get these red deads out of the way first. Ah, oh, you fucking bastard. Really? Two armour on one room. Alright, well. We've got some armor. We'll call that a trade for armor and health. That'll make us feel less salty about it. We can line these shots up and get both at once. Save on ammo. Oh, he decided he was going to despawn. It's all right. He's going to die nonetheless. Uh, we've got a shop that's blocked off via key, which is a real pain in the asshole. Uh, you know what? Once we've found our next teleporter, we're going to go through and buy the Elder Blank. We'll get an extra curse from it, but I think the trade-off is probably worth it. Oh, we one shot in these. Sweet. Well, chaos ensues there. guys are going down without too much of a fight today. Okay, so there's our teleporter. Let's come down here, get the other blank. Uh, we'll test it out, see if it's making much of a difference. If not, we'll use the cigarettes a couple of times. So we've got that and the six. So the recharge rate isn't too great at the moment. Does it increase? It increases when we kill the chickens, which is definitely pretty handy. Definitely going to incentivize us to use these cigarettes and to use the blanks and to kill the chickens. And the good thing is we can leave the chickens there until we need another recharge. Uh, then again, not that that's going to be much of an issue for us. Missing everything at the moment. That's better. Okay. What the fuck hit us then? Are you serious? Uh, we can't open that just yet. Oh, it's a real shame about the um, shop. Uh, we uh, we did have a lockpick. We should have tried that. I was kind of hoping for a key drop. Right, so there's the boss. You know what, I'll save using the cigarettes for now. Uh, we'll rock out Zilla shotgun 
and the bundle of wands. Um, I'm hoping for not the treadmill, which of course means we're going to get the treadmill and the jammed one as well. Really, really doesn't help our fucking chances. I think bundle of wands is going to be better for the reloading of the weapon. The shotgun takes a while to reload. Uh, I'm not too worried if I don't get a flawless on this fight, but I would quite like to survive. But if we can get a flawless nonetheless then I'm still going to go for it. Elder Blank saving us quite a bit of hassle here. Uh, almost didn't use that then. It's charging up nice and fast. He's going to be dead any second now. Just make it nice. So we managed to flawless the jammed treadmill. Exorcist, you've earned a trophy. Uh, sixth chamber unlocked. You what? A sixth chamber? I'll take it, whatever. Moonscraper, uh, armor. Uh, so we've got three flawlesses in a row, which I'm pretty stoked about. Uh, but still no goddamn keys. Um, you know what? I'm just going to check over here to see if the lockpick is still there because I left something behind before in this particular room and it's stuck. Oh no, the rat has had it. Alright, so we'll go open up our chest or shoot the chest. Um, we should have used uh, a couple of uses of cigarettes before picking up the armour but I didn't quite think about that. Uh, no blanks. Oh, actually, look at the elder blank. <laughs> Uh, but let's shoot this one up. We'll use the moon scraper just because it's a piece of shit. Uh, but we can't get into the shop, so we're a big shame. But you know what? I'm gonna go over to this guy. I'm gonna give him the moon scraper because I don't like it. And I'm gonna use the six a couple of times to get some health back. Uh, you know what? No, I'm going to hold on to the Phoenix. But if that's worked the way I think it's worked, then uh, we should have uh, a high recharge on the blanks now. Going down to the next chamber. So onto the hollow already. Um, how long have we been going for? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I haven't got a timer of any kind, I don't know why. I'm looking at my laptop for a timer, but um, there is no such thing. Uh, so we're carrying on using the hexagon just because that is just fucking raping shit up. And hopefully, this blank charges the way it's intended. Fucking hell, one shot in those guys. Okay. One shot in with the table tech rage. But still. I wonder if these cigarettes um, kind of revert back to their original state uh, upon clearing a room out. Missed there. Hunt complete. Okay, so we found all of our gun nuts. Uh, got another blank there. So next time we are in the um, breach. Oh, 
man, I got stuck on the wall there. Next time I'm in the breach, we can see what the hunter has to offer us. Uh, so we've got a shop. Oh man, so many good things. Ah, oh, we haven't got enough for that. Uh, what are they? The smoke bomb. We haven't had those before. Do we want to? No, I don't think we want to munch anything. I think we're doing all right uh, as things stand. Get over to this table. We'll flip that. Can we one-shot that guy? Yes, we can. We'll do the same with that guy. Oh, we missed. <laughs> okay. Could do with that ammo drop now. Uh, this room, I think we'll use the Phoenix. Because we're going to get all the um, spent enemies come up at us. There's a particular enemy here that spawns that can potentially give us infinite money. Uh, it usually spawns on this room. I haven't seen him yet. Ah, oh, here he is. So we can keep killing that guy. He's a jammed one, though. Oh no, he's not a jammed one. So there's uh, the case of the Elder Blank saving us there. It's that guy there. He'll just keep spawning that one enemy. Uh, and the more we kill him, the more money he's going to drop. We could just keep going and going. But I don't think we've got time for that today. I'm not going to be pissing about with that. Get more jammed than I'd like to see. But they're dead. Gun. One shot the Shelaton. He's going to try and spawn another one. You can take a shot at the back of the head, son. Alright, that's empty. Uh, you know what? We'll use the cold 45 and the um, Zilla shotgun. Try and get in close to get the full effect of the weapon. Uh, what have we got down here? One of these guys. Oh no, bad damage. Should be using this blank more often. It also does damage as well. So it's definitely worth using it. It's almost filled up again. Do we get a blank charge up for that as well? No, we don't. But we will for killing the chickens. We get quite a lot for killing the chickens. Was there one down here? That should give us a full blank charge again. Uh, which in turn saves our blanks for the boss, which in turn gives us a good chance to flawless bosses. Okay, wasting a lot of ammo there. Oh, no. Bad play there. Okay, we get too many of these. Too many. I mean, that's what you get for picking up the Elder Blank and generally getting more than one curse uh, per run. Where are you at? Down there. Not too hard to dodge, though. And we'll have another Blank charge in the next room. And a key drop. Which is nice, we haven't seen one of those for a while. Go through ammo very fast. Yeah, we'll keep going at this guy. Kill this one first, and then we'll kill this one. You know what? While he's frozen, maybe we we'll use our rogue special. It's just to conserve on ammo because otherwise we're going to be hemorrhaging ammo. We know we can dodge these guys fairly easily. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> fairly easily. I didn't say every time. Uh, but we could do. We have some health. Drop in. Um, have we found our shop yet? I don't remember seeing it. Oh, 
Why is he drawn to us? Alright, so that's empty. Um, use the Phoenix for now. Trying to save the better tiered weapons. Oh, I don't really want to have to use a key here, but I've got some help for it. Uh, and that'll give us some more curse, which I don't really want. I'm going to use the blank in here, though, just in case. Nope. Uh, let's come down here. As long as I can remember to flip these tables, uh, then our damage is going to be through the roof. We flipped too early. Got this guy again. There was a table there we could have flipped on the way through. It's too late now. Ah, oh, there's our balloon. I completely forgot about that. Where's he gone? Let's collect that. And the army's in here as well, which is pretty handy. So we can send that up to the hollow now. Uh, not the hollow, the black powder mine. Which we'll do just now. Arm sent to previous chamber. Nice. One less thing to do. Well, one easier thing to do, which is not always something that happens. We haven't found our oh, we have had the shop because it's all over there. So, 96. Uh, we'll buy the key. We'll buy the half heart. Use the cigarettes. We'll buy the armor. Bit of tactical mitmax in there. Um, we're yet to find. We're yet to find another chest. So, we've got a key for that one at least. Uh, unfortunately, no armor, but uh, there's a boss. We don't want to go there quite yet. Um, not armor, ammo. So if we can find some ammo, I'll be reasonably pleased. What's he going to do over there, mate? Books. Set those motherfuckers on fire. Straight up. Okay, so there's that ammo. Uh, what do we want to fill up? The hexagon. Definitely. And we'll stick with the phoenix until the ammo goes for that, and then we'll switch back over to the hexagon. Ah. I dodged just a little bit out of sync to where that bullet was. Oh, I wanted the hexagon instead. I didn't realise the... Ammo mats are still alive, so we'll kill him. And that fly is still around. It keeps flying past my face, but I can't do anything about it while I'm in a room like this. Right, so we've got a blank charge again. Let's open up our chest. The SAA? SAA. Use the elder blank in here. Nope, nothing. There's a chicken down there that we can use. Oh, was there a chicken? There is. That we can use to fill up the blank. And one more room, it seems like. Do we want to use the SA? I'm going to use the SAA for the rest of the floor clearing. Just because it's got good reload time. And it's not the most powerful weapon, but it will do enough damage to kind of warrant being able to use it on this floor as opposed to the Rogue Special. Uh, reload time and shot speed is just a bit slower. Um, you know what, I'm not going to bother using any more blanks for secret rooms. Um, one quick check in the shop again. Uh, so there's that potion, but... Do we want to get rid of anything? Um, Phoenix and the Cold 45. You know what, I'm going to get rid of the Phoenix and Cold 45. In the hopes of getting a very good weapon. In my head, they're very similar tiered weapons, but we've got the Winchesters uh, shotty 
or the oh no, the dueling pistol show. Sorry. Um, even so, um, damage-wise, it's probably not too bad. Oh, what am I doing? What am I doing? I think we use the hexagon and maybe SAA for a few clutch shots in case we need to make them. Who have we got? The high priest. I don't think we're going to flawless, flawless this one. Nope, didn't happen. But we're going to survive. Which is the most important thing. I don't think the hexagon is very good for this fight. Let's try the uh, Zilla. If we can get close enough to the guy anyway. Oh, we used that too late. It's not going very well. That's why we're not shooting. Okay. Gotta be more careful. You know what? Maybe bundle of ones is gonna be better for us. I'm not quite fancying my chances at the moment. But this looks like it's gonna get that consistent damage down on him. Got the elder blank charged up again. Hopefully we won't have to waste it in this portion of the battle. Ah, oh, but I think we're going to have to. But we can get another charge up pretty quickly on that. Ali takes I think two and a half, three clips to do so. Oh, we're empty on that one as well now. Few more shots. That's all we need. Oh, by the skin of our teeth. Polaris unlocked. Hollowed out trophy. Okay. Uh, we get a bit of help. Oh, we've got a ration. That's fantastic. Uh, well, we're going to swap the cigarettes over for the ration. Uh, because if we've got that, if we die, we'll come back with some health. Or we could just use it now and keep the cigarettes. Do we want to do that? You know what? I think we'll. We've got a blank left. Secret room. Let's check through here. No. Okay, well, we're going down to the forge anyway. Not much health. Got a bit of coinage, so if we make it to the blacksmith, we might be able to get some health back. But it just means we're going to have to be a bit more diligent with our play now. Uh, although. We lost quite a lot of ammo on that fight. But I do want to stick with the hexagon to clear these rooms out. So, just got to be super careful. Ah! Oh. That's really interesting. The fact that you can turn death into a chicken. You can't kill him, but you can turn him into a chicken. Uh, what do we want back? A uh, bundle of wands, I think, is going to be the most effective. If we can turn the enemies into chickens at the very least, then that's going to ease up on the damage we take. Might as well use the Elder Blank there just to give us a bit of extra time. Uh, again, the chickens are going to knock that right back up uh, for use in the next room. 
Okay, we found this straight away, so we'll get the full heart. Uh, there is ammo there to be bought. Alien engine, Colts, 1881. Uh, we'll get the bullet as well. Uh, ammo, 41. So we can't afford the ammo. But we found that pretty quickly. It's not usually the case. Oh, that's not an enemy. Not quite one shot on these guys anymore, but I didn't expect to uh, on the forge. We can just sneak our shots through there. Did get a key. That'll come in handy. Don't think we get a shop on the forge, or the blacksmith kind of um, takes over from the shop. <coughs> the rooms have not been too bad so far. <coughs> Got more health than what we began with. Right. While well, he is occupied, sneak a few shots in. Is he dead? Nice. So the health is starting to get fairly low. Hopefully he'll set himself on fire. We can save on a bit of ammo. Although that would have only taken one or two shots to kill him. Uh, what have we got? 24 money. <clears throat> Down to 16. You know what? I'd rather not deal with that guy at all. And that's the exact reason why. Oh, there's no enemies in here. He was still coming after us, that son of a bitch. Alright, so there's the dragon. I really want to find some extra stuff here. Chests or anything, really. What are we missing? There we go. Alright, so there should be a chest down there. So we're going to have to make our fight our way around. Not a particular fan of this room, but it's going to be worth doing. Okay, so that's M2. SAA. Shouldn't be taking any damage here, not from these guys. These guys are fairly small fry, jammed or not. Hopefully we can get a drop in this room of some sort. Nope. Didn't quite happen. As long as I've got enough ammo to get through the dragon fight, uh, I'm not too concerned about anything else. Ugh. Almost took some bad damage there. So here's our chest. Green chest. Frost giant. Now we recently unlocked this. Let's use it for now. Got a few more rooms left, so, so we should have one chest left <coughs> to open up. Ah, uh, that shit isn't cool. I want to kill him as soon as possible. Hey, fighter, how you doing? Die, does he? Turn him into a chicken instead. <laughs> right, a bit of armor, just what we needed. Joking. Oh man. That just screwed us right over. Oh, 
do have the ration though. I don't want to have to use it until we get to the dragon at least. Oh, but we've used it. Too late. We had a chest in here, but that didn't happen. It's got to be here. It's got to be our chest now. Yeah. And we get the eye bomb companion. PS4. Oh, nice one. Nice one. Where are you getting that one? Um, we'll go for the ammo. Don't think the hex gun's shot speed is fast enough. I think the big, uh, the frost giant is the way forward. Let's go to the boss target. Good price or no? Two blanks, two health. Oh, it was a good run. Not, I can't be too mad about that one. It was a good run. We died due to us being idiots. Uh, let's go back down to the breach. 